Hello everybody, welcome back to the channel. We're running a late model open series race here for Pit lane speed three, limit uh, is 35 one. miles per hour. Season two, excuse me. Exit's clear. Two. Push. Okay, okay Jake. Late. We've got two laps. Let's get this series. But gonna see what we can do. Going out for qualifying. A little bit of a weaker feel, a little bit of a smaller, I think it, uh, smaller feel. I think it gets split three times, I wanna say. So just gonna see what we can do. Obviously, just overshot one and two really bad, so this lap's not going to be very good. Um, really, my goal is to build a start on the inside row. If I can do that, I'll be pretty happy. We'll see if we can try to improve on the second lap. P4, the lap typically, I've been faster on the first lap than the second. Yeah. So, yep, dumb move there. Uh, just overdrove it, trying to dig, get all I can. So, fortunately, not going to be a 0x for the whole session, but hopefully, we can get a 0x for the. Uh, uh, the race looks like a couple of people might have done the same thing, spun off, so looks like we're waiting on one driver. We are car number five, you can see out of 12, so um, fourth. Honestly, if I wouldn't have overdriven, would have been close to being the third, so I feel like we probably got the pace to uh, possibly keep up with the drivers, um, the, the, th the front three. I, I think with about a tenth over... Um, you know, the nine should be able to hopefully get by him. It's just going to be a matter of if he gets a good enough start to uh, to pull by me. Um, I'll load up the race setup. This this one is uh, just with how late of the week, you know, I, I really didn't even feel like I built session. a great Before. setup. Um, so you'll see a, another late model open series race happen probably pretty quickly. Um, just a few days after this one air. So. That'll be for the uh, the week four at USA International. That setup will also uh, that will be available on Team Goon Squad. Um, I'll have a link in the description box for that one. Feeling pretty good about that setup. We'll just see where Coach it's at. Triple but teammate is in front of me. Same thing. Um, as always, gonna try to run the chat, see if I can oh, yeah, see hear anything. If I run into anybody, you know, apologize to them. Whatever. Hopefully, okay, it okay. Uh, you know keeps it a little bit uh, a little bit more clean and, and easier to uh, you know not make people angry so just gonna make sure paints are good and then we'll get into I think looks like everybody's well, lined up on the outside. You can take them on the outside, see how many uh, cars are off from the uh, the grid numbers gonna get session best lap hold up 50 this laps. one they can count the track temp is 83 the air temp is 81 four right. inside Zamsky again two. shut up please one and two, um, I don't know. I, I might have pace to honestly keep up with some of these guys. We'll just have to I, I feel like might be a little bit off on the front end, um, but my, I, my race setup I don't feel like is quite as fast up front, but I don't think it falls off quite as bad as some people, so over the 50 laps, hopefully if I don't fall back too far and can keep it somewhat close, then um, potentially could uh, possibly try to to make some moves, see if we can improve. I uh, hope that we can get a good enough start that I don't have to be under attack from everybody in the inside row and get freight train to go to the back, but I'm just gonna be try, try to be as patient as I can I work back. the outside until I feel like I have an opening and then, and then get down and, and try to, you know, fall in line. Like every short track, it's a, it's a one-group track. I love running here, it just, uh, it's kinda how short tracks are for the most part, so same way in real life, so just gonna try to do what we can, get ready to go here. Okay, Jay, One's go. off and early. Go. So that, that start really helped uh, trick the people behind, so it will pull away. It looks like one. I don't know what happened there. I don't know if he ever drove or what happened, but I'm just going to take it real easy and watch what happens. Let you read what's going on there. Hold your line. See if I can pull away from him. Clear. Oh. I think he would have gotten a black flag. I don't know. We'll see. But in any event, that's a free position, so that puts us up into third. P3. The leader's just done it. Just really got to drive in as easy as I can. Make sure I get the car slowed down enough in the corner. Team's got a massive gap over the four. Force a little loose getting into the corner. And I do the same thing off the corner. Thankfully, able to save it. The nine had the problem, so thankfully, with nine having this issue, that uh, gave me that big, big advantage there. Um, allowed me to make that mistake and still be okay. So front three are now spread out pretty much. Nine loses it again in the turn four area. So 
massive gap out behind, so you just done really can just focus on pulling the tires back down and trying to uh, drive as clean as I can. But third place, not a bad, not a bad spot to be in. To keep an eye on the gap, 1.4 up to the 4, 2.8 to the 2. That was a just have to watch everything to see if I can uh, gain on anybody. I would expect for them to pull away. But like I said, if I don't fall off as hard, maybe if I don't lose too much, I can try to try to close back in on the back half of the race. B3, you've just done a 14, but 9 full. Check the gap out back as well. We've got a pretty huge lead. It looks like uh, maybe a quarter of a lap to a third of a lap. 2.7 back, and still 1.4 to the uh, to the four up ahead. So keep the pace. All right, Jake. The next car is an half lap car, which is gonna you know. Close the gap up, but then stretch it back out when we go to get by him. Four makes contact with the 11. You're not really sure top what happened there. We'll the take a look and see. I don't know if the 11 came up or if the four just kind of crowded him. Obviously, he wanted to be on the inside of the 11 so he could get by him a bit cleaner. So that might be the uh, six the in pit was road as well. A few problems that allowed us to close up to the four. Gap's pretty consistent to the two up ahead. Picked up about a tenth, but obviously I didn't drive that last lap very well, so. Your last lap time was. We'll have to see what we can do. It's going to be pretty uh, tough to uh, be able to close up consistently unless they really fall off hard compared to me because, um, you know, it's, it's one thing to catch them, it's another thing to, to get by them, so. Really have to close up a lot faster in order to be able to get to them. Car feels pretty good, and I mean, with most oval cars, if you overdrive the corner, well, it's going to get loose. 14, Outside of that, it's, uh, Tom's in front is it's now pretty comfortable, honestly. Zero, zero. I'm pretty happy with it for the limited amount of time I had to, uh, to build the setup. It, it feels pretty com pretty comfortable, so looks like we're keeping pace with the two. Time was 14, Just, uh, he got the benefit of... Being able to pull away from the one and all the stuff that happened with the one off the start, as well as you know, me obviously having that that slide out of four that one lap, but we're starting to pull away a little that bit. That was the like bit zero loose zero on entry. Don't know if that's hurt his regular tire attempts at all or not. Thank you. Just continue to work smoothly. Only 15 laps done. Oh, so time was still a long way to go. Try to go. Make sure I don't yeah, overshoot the corners, can't afford to give up any time on the corners like that, but... See how quickly we can work by the one when we get to him. See if he'll extend the same courtesy. He extended the four. So we'll probably catch him into one and two. Right side. Kind of gave it to us, but he's still there. Keep digging. Really, not much. He's still there. Link, so. to better pine. Thanks, I appreciate it. So we'll try to be a little bit of a nicer driver. You've just done a little bit mutual respect as well as a comfortability. You know, try to drive clear and run these guys how I want to be ran. It's not a uh, crazy huge driver pool in the short track series, so run them every week, you're going to run into the same the guys 15, a lot, and it's like zero five. a lot better to build a nice, you know, rapport with them than uh, have somebody, you know, hate you, or the whole group hate you, and then it's not going to be a fun time. Well, that was a 15.01. Oh, dumbass, we just barely clipped the wall there, gotta avoid that. Definitely closing in on the four. Slowly closing in on the two, I think we're just uh, not quite fast enough to get to the two at the time, but sights are set on the four, see if we can get there before the end of the race to pull off a second place finish. Hey, Arthur, can you, uh, I feel like I'm uh, entering the corners a little better than him, but I don't know, we'll just have to see how it goes. We'll be approaching halfway in the next couple of laps. Races are quick, but feel like they take a while sometimes, although I'm sure that's just because I'm still trying to get more comfortable with running more towards the front, so the pressure feels like every moment slows down quite a bit. 
try to time this as best as I can and not lose too much time with the 12. See if I can sneak by him here. One I'm on the same room. time as the 12. Clear high. Able to clear him, so that allowed us to close up a little bit. Definitely closing up on the two as well. I just don't think we're doing it fast enough to build against him. Okay, Jake. Halfway home. Okay, I have good. to chart, trying to figure out where the four is going to make the mistake. He's going to start entering a little bit slower to try to protect the bottom, as he should. So he's going to figure out how I can try the to lap time was at back that and try to get by him cleanly. He's going to allow the uh, two to be able to pull away as soon as we start battling side by side. Or if I have to, you know, sit and wait the four out. That was at 15.18. Just going to keep driving my line for right now. We're not quite there yet. So I got to keep driving my same line in order to close up to him. Both of us together are definitely approaching just the two. 15.16. Nothing else. I'm going to try to give you guys a good battle in the last 20 laps or so for second place. That was a chance to right get side. to the inside. Left side line's clear. Yeah, I'm on right side. Trying right. to keep it off of them. It's on one side. Still there. Three up there. They're outside. I'm just going to wait for him to make the They're mistake. Outside. Now I've got to make sure that I don't make the mistake back, because otherwise I'll hand the position Three, right two. back that to him. Uh, Happy to have passed him cleanly. Just got to make I'm sure I run it as clean as I can. I will gladly take a second place finish in this race. So we're definitely faster than he is pulling away from him. Got just 18 laps to go. Your last lap time was at 15. Sure you don't want to shoot the corners. Closing in on the two, but the Maybe lap car that we've got the seven up here, it's going to end up opening back up. So. I think I'm going to be more content to defend second and not make any mistakes and try to push it to get to the five. Let's see if we can buy the seven here off of turn four, two and three, one and two. Yeah, I'm on right side. Kind of gives us the lane, not too much. Still there, clear up high. B2. Was able to get by him without any problems as well. Caps stay pretty consistent to the two, but he's working lap traffic up ahead as well, so it's obviously slowed him down with both the 11 and the 1 up there. Stay high in that corner, we done. The problem with the uh, 4, we've got just uh, 14 to go now. Hey, I don't know, 4 eight. that's very fun, man. Did he really cut you? Like close enough to the two, but again, he was dealing with the lap traffic in the one. Levin just, yeah, I, I don't know what he did. Go by, but Maybe that was the seven. Went right in front of me, break early in traffic. I didn't touch him, he didn't. Try to get it. by the one quickly again, so he didn't lose too much time to the four. Right side. Thanks again, Justin. Really glad that the one's been so respectful. It's nice to have guys up here at the front that are able to treat each other as cleanly as possible. I mean, the four knew that he made a mistake. We got to his inside and he ran us cleanly. I appreciate that for short track. You know, some guys tend to uh, get to be a little aggressive. So. Just nine laps to go. We've got to cut down massive well, amounts of two, which I don't think is going to happen. But certainly happy to uh, be this close to the two. One car blinking. Got to watch out for that if we get to him. Time right now, really got to make sure I don't make any mistakes. Got a nice gap ahead of the four, so no reason to throw it away. The chances of me getting the two are so slim. Happy enough knowing that we're just keeping pace with them. That uh, you know, even though it's not a win, that's that's worth a lot in my mind right now. I 
have six to go this time by as we are working lap 45 or 50. Last time was 50, uh, one, nine, two, three. The gap to Thompson behind is increasing. It's now Definitely one, all the way two, from six. the uh, four. I feel like we could have contended with the two if I wouldn't have had that. That spin mistake off his turn four. One, two, zero. And of course, you know, with the whole deal with the one, obviously allowed the pull away a little bit, so. It was all my fault for not being able to contend for the win, but push, you know, push, push. certainly uh, in this. feel like I uh, had a pretty good car this one. 15, three, three. I feel like overall minus, I mean that was a pretty big mistake, but overall minus that felt like I drove pretty well, so. Let's see how I can get by the 7 and the 8, not a ton to worry about with just 3 to go, but I don't want any chance of the 4 coming back in, so. These two are battling yeah, for positions, so I'm going to try to figure out two. what's going to be the best way to handle them. Should be fine to probably just sit behind him. Obviously, it's allowing the uh, two to pull away, but I know two where I stood with on. pace good for in relation to the two. I think uh, it's probably just smart to, to sit behind these two, not try to force it, run the risk of you know getting into a wreck with them just to give up second place. Okay, Jake, one more to go. Keep it together. We'll be on the podium. The captain is kind of behind us situational now. awareness and trying six. to learn to be better at. 15.46. And we're going to bring it home in second place, so really happy with that drive. Really happy with the drive. Podium finish. Good win, Devin. Nice one. Thank you, man. Really happy with that drive. That uh, feels like probably one of the better short track races I've run, especially yeah. between a pace perspective and uh, Mid -lane speed limit is racecraft miles thinking about hour. stuff, trying to be as clean as I could. Three. Take a Two. look at the battle between the uh, the four and I. I think that was a pretty Box good. Nail. Pretty good one to watch. I mean, it's only a couple laps, but we'll also take a look and see what happened with the one off the start. I don't know what happened there. So. Reckon I'm out here after this one. Pull up one. Wind this a little bit and see what happened. Look at it from the lower chase so we can see. I don't know if he went too early. I didn't hear in the chat what he said, so he's warming the tires up, laying back from the pace car. I think he might have gone early. I don't know. It's hard to say whether or not that was considered early or not. Because he was off and rolling, and all of a sudden he just had to give up. Like, it's like he intentionally gave up the spot, so I'm wondering if he got black flag for, for going early. I think he mentioned something on the chat, I didn't hear it. Um, that one might have been a shot from the floor, I don't think so, but, um, he was definitely letting everybody go, so I'm wondering if he had a black flag. We'll have to see, I think he ended up, uh, I don't know if he came in the pit or not. Yeah, I, it, maybe he jumped early, it's, it's hard to say that way, I don't know, um, but that's, you know, definitely something, something was up that way, so, um. Zoom this out, bring this up a little bit so we can watch. Uh, I want to use this view to watch the battle between the f the four and I. Um, but yeah, that was kind of weird. I mean, that was definitely worth a free spot, obviously, which helped out big time. Probably would have only been a, a third place car had it not been for that. But um, yeah, you know, not bad. So obviously, I had that stupid lap where you know I gave up. But uh, this one right here, I got I got lucky enough that just literally. Uh, just got on the throttle a little too hard and, and just got it around. Was so lucky that the nine that I was able to save it and that the nine was so far back. So, um, but yeah, we will. Uh, I think uh, that was the spot there. Try to figure out where I got by him. Okay, so. So rewind it about half a lap or so. Um, like I said, I had been consistently watching the four kind of overdriving the corner entry. You would see him slide just like that right there. Just like that right there. That he was sliding the, the car up the track, kind of, you know, over rotating on entry. So as soon as he kind of did that, gave me that inside line, I, I decided to get to the inside of him and uh, kept it off of him. You know, it was just he gave the bottom lane open, so I had to take it. And then he uh, did a good job backing off. Like, he really... I think he understood that I was faster and uh, was, was really respectful, let me 
you know, not trying to, to force it down or pinch me down off the corner or anything like that. Like, super respectful out of him. So, that was, uh, yeah, I, it was just one of those that I kind of had the opening. I had to take it. I couldn't I couldn't wait. Um, otherwise, I might not get by him. So, certainly had to do it and then just uh, try to chase him down. So, I uh, felt like that was, you know, a, a better pass than I normally have. Um, pretty happy with that. So, take a look at the, looks like uh, a few people had some issues. So, um not sure what happened there, but we'll take a look at the results. Should be a, uh, hopefully a fairly decent gain. Um, lost a little bit from, uh, you know, some of the oval races I've done this week, but that should definitely help out. Was a, uh, uh, two split. So we had 24 entries in total. Um, so 2005 strength to feel pretty weak, but again, you know, it's back end one of the few last races for this week. So a lot of, you know, a lot of the quick guys aren't there. Um, Certainly nowhere near as fast as some of the guys up front. Um, you know, the the four was technically faster than us. The uh, the two was faster than us. But I, I feel like I had, I didn't fall off quite as hard. So I feel like I was able to uh, to keep pace with them better. Um, you know, obviously sat behind the uh, the seven and the eight and just let them go. So that's kind of why that interval opened up a little bit. Probably could have been within a second. So, you know, to be within a, a couple hundreds in terms of the average lap time, especially with that slide, you know, that added like, three quarters of a second there i'm i'm really happy with that so able to gain 67 i rating so back over 2400 able to gain uh 0.63 so 0.23 from the race and then 0.4 for the bump so back up to 3.49 almost to the 4.0 should be able to get to a license if i can keep it clean relatively soon um yeah that uh i guess allows me the ability if i want to try to run daytona on the arca series i i feel a little more flexible with that but yeah that was certainly a uh, good race hopefully you guys enjoyed that feel free to leave any comments you got um i like i said i i'm Wondering, I didn't hear what happened on the chat. I'm guessing it's the one jump the uh, pace car just slightly early. He was trying to time it as early as he could and might have gotten just just slightly early. But, um, you know, feel free to uh, let me know if, if you notice something different or, or if you happen to hear something or whatever. Um, you know, all ears. Just uh, love to hear from you guys in general. So hopefully you guys enjoyed that one. And until the next one, I hope all your laps are fast, your races are clean, and your finishes are good. Thanks for watching.